But in today's world where chat GDP has taken over everything and AI is disrupting everything, isn't that a real business threat for you? Yeah, I mean, just aside, Sam Altman is my friend and dorm mate from Stanford. We studied together and I met him when he was in India right now. And he himself said he's amazed and happy for what MapMundi has achieved. Uh, so we take every innovation in our stride. We've been at the cutting edge since 1995. We pioneered digital maps. We started internet mapping before Google Maps existed worldwide. Uh, this end case is first of its kind. When the metaverse and mixed reality is coming, we're well positioned with our own 3D, 4D, HD maps for the real world since the last few years. So I think we know how to both write as well as create the next wave of technology. And uh, despite a global giant which monopolizes this sector in the consumer space, we've been able to deliver pretty strong growth at very high margins. So I'm very confident that as technology uh, uh, plays a larger role in the economy, it's actually companies like Mapma India, which will face a lot of, uh, which will have a lot of growth. Uh, so we, we're, my, we're excited. My basic point is perhaps at an intellectual level, what you have is IP and IP in a sense is something which is your proprietary, which is mapping and, you know, coding. My only thought here is that in today's world where things are just getting marginalized, could an AI engine, in a sense, challenge the basic USP what you have? Um, I think we use AI to actually create maps. I think this is what we've been doing for the last four or five years. And if you look at MapMania's margin profile, we're highly cost efficient because of our ability to create maps and technology. So AI is a tool. I think everybody realizes that. And those who can use the tool better will become bigger and better in terms of offering the solution. So I'm excited about AI. I'm excited about the metaverse. The more uh, people build mixed reality headsets, the more MapMedia will be used. Spatial computing we are talking about, and we're a geospatial uh, data and technology company. So, so, I mean, at an intellectual level, I'm very happy that uh, new technology is coming up because we'll be at the forefront of leveraging that, if not also creating that.